some wins and some losses for SpaceX after their most recent launch. So early yesterday, one of their Falcon 9 rockets lifted off from Cape Canaveral in Florida. It was carrying 21 Starlink satellites into orbit. All of those made it successfully. However, when the reusable part of the rocket, the first stage booster landed again on that unmanned ship, it tipped over went up in flames. That's what you see right there. SpaceX says they are going to review data from the flight. The Federal Aviation Administration has now grounded all of the company's Falcon 9 rockets. They are ordering an investigation into what went wrong there. No one was injured, though, in that incident. It's unclear what exactly it will mean for a couple of SpaceX's upcoming manned missions. Earlier this week, the Polaris Dawn mission was canceled due to a helium leak. This is a private trip into space. It's scheduled to carry another New Englander past the Carmen line. Retired Air Force Lieutenant Colonel Scott, a.k.a. Kid Petit, is a New Hampshire native and a graduate of UNH. The mission is set to go 800 miles into space, further than a human has gone since the Apollo missions. And another astronaut is set to conduct the first commercial spacewalk. A date has not yet been scheduled for this mission, which would need a Falcon 9 rocket. SpaceX also has a flight scheduled for NASA in early September. This is the mission that would eventually bring home the Starliner astronauts who are currently stranded on the International Space Station.